this is what I have, just which I've been wearing. I've never worn massive cross to which I won't even do to work, and I've worn it since I was employed with it. And no patient has ever complained. I've not harmed any patient, and I've not harmed myself because they said I can harm a patient with this. There is no evidence that uh, my cross, since I've been wearing it, has ever caused an infection. And for instance, we, I wear some, sometimes glasses, and many people wear eyeglasses. We wear, people wear yarn lads. Wedding ring is accepted, earring is accepted, and uh, pass and bunch of keys. We all attach that. So cross does not make any difference. So if I'm allowed to wear longer chain, then what happened to the cross? Why is it not allowed? So there's no evidence that my cross I've worn for many years has ever caused any infection or health and safety. Other people wear other things because I could still see a lot of people wearing jewelry. They were not asked to remove their own. And um, for instance, even the day I was approaching theater to remove my Cross, the uh, one of the staff there as well had a blue pendant on and a silver. She was not uh, approached at all. So, and a lot of other people still wearing different kind of jewelry. Because of my stand not removing my cross. I have been removed from clinical area uh, to do some odd jobs with the clerk, different, different wards, they keep sending me to different wards, one week here, two weeks here, one week here till now. And this is the job I love doing. I've been prevented just because I have the cross on not to do the job. And they hire agency staff or other staff to do my job. 